What's going on, everybody? What's going on, YouTube Big Country? Coming at you one more again. As usual, I have my lovely assistant, my wife, Miss Country. And um, Mr. Lansky should be joining us directly. If not, he won't be joining us. Um. As y'all know, he has been dealing with stuff with his mother, so he may be dealing with stuff with his mother. Well, poor trail. Welcome, welcome. We got a treat for y'all tonight. Can y'all hear us good? Yeah, can you hear us good? I've been searching for a swing away tongue for my boat trailer. It seems that my boat trailer has a. All right, Mark. All right, thank you. One, two, three. Hello. Blue. Blue. Yep, you're right. Oh. Oh. <clears throat> swing away tongue system for my boat trailer. And my boat trailer has an odd size. It's not a two inch, but it's not a three inch. That's a two and a half inch, and I can't find a two and a half inch. Mechanism. Y'all see me looking down. Um, that's what I'm doing. Oh, let me get this thing here over here. The way I gotta pull out my nine her. Welcome, welcome. Ten already? Man. I try to show Big Country some love already. Y'all see me looking down. That's what I'm looking at. I'm going to look down for a few minutes until uh, we all get in here and everybody gets in here for a few minutes. Uh, let's see. It's, uh, How's it going, big homie? Give us a sneak peek of what's going to happen tonight. <laughs> Something behind my hand. <laughs> we got the little Miss Kaya Rose. Yep, she, she's uh doing her thing. Oh, there you go. She wants the colors. Yeah, and it is over here. What? Uh, you up there with Eddie? You ain't getting up here with me. What's up? What's going on? Of course you can't see what's behind his hand. <laughs> <laughs> nope. All right, now. Get on over yonder now. Uh, of course, Donuts is asking him questions. Uh, open face turkey sandwich with gravy or Salisbury steak? Probably turkey sandwich. Salisbury steak. Of course, what kind of salisbury? Homemade salisbury. I don't like homemade salisbury steak. I like the uh, banquet salberry steak. Welcome in there and Mike. Turkey. Yeah. Are you going to be making that homemade barbecue sauce soon? Did you tell them about homemade barbecue sauce? I, I don't know. Did somebody I, I don't, I don't remember, you? I don't know. I don't remember saying something about homemade barbecue sauce. I could have said something about it last week. I don't remember. It depends on what salberry steak, what, what kind of salberry steak you talk about. Banquet. <laughs> Banquet Salisbury State is one I eat. And when I, I grew up eating, when I started eating, when we, when we got together, I was eating it. And oh, she's already getting on the cover on the bed. No, she's sitting over there gnawing. I oh, think he so said bad. something about, you know, eat for oh, Okay. Okay. Well, I can make some homemade. He says, he says a lot of things, y'all. Yeah, I said a lot of things. <laughs> Sometimes I be talking about stuff and I don't even realize I be talking about stuff. <laughs> Y'all got to keep me straight. And Buster Puffy, they still here. Yeah, they still here. Anybody want one? Just let me know. Yeah, please do. <laughs> please do. <laughs> please, they get big and fat. They might make an appearance here directly. Yeah, they 
Mmm. Real burgers, they come out with onions, peppers, and gravy. Mm hmm. No, man. That sounds pretty good. Three times. Got them note notes running around. Brad is the one, remember? He come a snake. He watched your uh short and he said the note notes. And you and you said, uh, um, I reckon that means yep, yep for me. Yep, yep. <laughs> I better get one the other day, but it was a little bit too fast for me. Um, I'm not sure if it was a water moccasin or a black racer, but uh anyway, I was gonna try to grab it, but uh it got a little too fast and it got up in the cold grab. And then my wife said, get back in this car. And plus, I was part, double parked in the road. I was sideways in the road. That means he, he just wants to go play with them. Yeah, I want to go play with them. Yeah, I like play. Him. I've been playing with snakes since I was knee-high to a grasshopper. Rattlesnake. Okay, I love playing with rattlesnakes. Rattlesnakes are full. Yeah, he thought about it. T-shirts for one more again. Oh, oh, it's coming! It's coming! I just got. Oh, hold on, y'all. Hold on. We got. We got the man, the okay. myth, the legend, Mister Lexi Jackson. <laughs> What's going on, folks? Uh, we were just waiting on you, and I'm searching for stuff on the phone. They talking about uh, doing burgers on the grill. Burgers on the grill. Uh, yeah, they was talking about uh, onions and mushrooms. Put them on the burgers. That sounds pretty good with some, some good old hook cheese. Mm -hmm. the boat oh, what's cheese. going on, everybody? I'm kind of like Phoebe's picture on there, lifting the boats. But well, she's the a little darker than Phoebe. Mm -hmm. and the, the, yeah. yeah, it has been good to see him. We ain't seen him a few days this week. Yeah, well, hold on a minute, y'all. Hold on a minute. Y'all talk to Mr. Vanchiki. Hold on. I'm coming, girl. She won't run into the blanket. Come on. <clears throat> yeah, we've been having some complications <laughs> with the mom this week. That's uh, why I haven't been around. And that's what I have just mentioned it. Yeah, yeah. But uh, I should have a better week this coming week. I hope. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> that's good. Can you guess? What behind big country hand? <laughs> Y'all paying attention last week, y'all would know. Oh. Ah. Trivia ah. questions. So how's everybody doing? How the weekend was going? How the week went. Yeah, how your week went. Oh Lord. I ain't seen skin on snake yet and eat it. <laughs> no, okay, every time I catch a rattler, somebody else can eat it before I get a chance to eat it. I think I told this story a while back. I was at work. <laughs> and I was on the tractor. Uh, this has been years ago now. He's already breaking out snake swords. Yeah. Oh my. And there's a Nice rattlesnake about about three foot long. Going across the road, oh, mine is on business. I said, I got you now, sucker. And I pulled that tractor tire right up on top of his head. So he couldn't turn around about himself. So we did that out and I get down there and chop his head off of my knife. Take it back to the shop. Not because I was heading back to the shop to the farm. I said, my brother in law, now he like to cook stuff like that. I said, you cook him up and not eat it. <laughs> Everybody at that farm got some for I didn't. When I got ready to get some, wasn't there left. No, they did. They put it right at the shop. They put it at the shop and ate it up there. Every one of them got some. They wanted some. Yeah, I didn't get none. And I'm the one that brought it up there. My snake too. <laughs> Man, I was mad. What did you learn? Don't let somebody don't else share. cook. Don't, don't share. Right. Don't, don't let somebody else cook your food. Look at yourself. <laughs> I remember a story y'all pranked that fella with the snake. Speaking of 
<laughs> I got that video somewhere. I can't remember. Speaking of special eats, you still got that special stuff you were talking about the other day you showed me? In the jar? <laughs> you talking about what's behind my hand? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if they can guess what it is, I might eat it. Okay. Without oh. saying, do you eat them things, Tom? I do not eat those. No. She has never eaten them. I've never tried them, but just to. I, I, yeah. We're gonna try it tonight. <laughs> same, same. I've never tried them. I sure do love me some. Eat snake sushi next time. No, nah, you gotta cook that stuff there. Red light like some hoop cheese. Heck yeah! And find out that hoop cheese is a Oh, you don't know what hoop cheese is? It's it's <laughs> like a it's it's basically like a really it's like a wedge of uh, sharp cheddar, and mm -hmm. it's in the wax. It's usually yeah, the red wax on the outside, the red, yeah, what got, we call the rind. Yeah, the red, red rind wax that protects it. Mm -hmm. It's called hoop cheese down here. Well, what you do is you take that, put it on the car, the, the, the dashboard of your car for about 15, 20 minutes in the sunshine. Let it get nice and... It makes me grilled cheese. Nice it's so stuff. good. It is so good, though. I think it's better than just regular Tritter. It is. I, I was thinking about getting some to have with that tonight, but I forgot oh, about getting a nice salad. It slices those yeah. around. Yeah, they, they have it sliced. Yeah. yeah. And they, 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 they overcharge you for it, too. You notice that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It, it, I, I'm not. Can you get it extra sharp, Tom? Huh? Um, I, I, I don't think it could get no sharper than it already is, can it? <laughs> it's pretty, pretty, pretty. It's pretty, yeah. I'm saying. It's pretty tart. Yeah. I, I like sharp cheese, though, and extra sharp. I love it. I used to be like it, but. I, I, I don't wore it down yeah. with my macaroni. I don't wore it down. That's what I put in my macaroni. Not that. Not the hoop cheese, but. uh. <laughs> Portrell's in, in Tennessee is black wine. Black yeah, wine? Well, Okay. Up at that meat store, I get it. You could get it neither red or the black rind. I never seen it in the black rind. Mm -hmm. I would have thought something was wrong with it. What they got it? <laughs> black rind is the real one. Oh, okay. Well, I might have to come to Tennessee. They're saying he can do the Carolina Reapers, but not the sun cheese. <laughs> <laughs> It just gets, gets warm. You just let it get warm and soft in the sun. You don't I'm, sit in there and... It don't get sour or nothing now. It, tastes, it just makes it taste better. I know we had a conversation before. Where they come get cheese when you eat little. Make the best, best grilled cheese sandwiches for a whole week. That no, government cheese is good if you can get your hands on it. Sun cheese with some sun tea. <laughs> What's wrong with that? Hello, uh, <laughs> more That's going in. Oh, that's going in. Oh, we'll take that <laughs> one to go. <laughs> uh, Lord, Lord, Lord. So is uh, your mama settling in pretty good? Yeah. Uh, so for 20 days, and 20 days only, she is in a nursing facility to do rehab. Try to get her back to baseline to where she was walking and stuff the way she was before she went in for her heart procedure. Okay, that's good. <clears throat> And what if she needs more therapy after the 20 days? I don't know. That's mm. all That's all the insurance cover. So yeah. hopefully they get it done in 20 days. <laughs> oh. That insurance hell, ain't it? Well, it would have been a 90-day thing if she'd have got that three-day hospital thing I told you about straight. Yeah, back. I know. <clears throat> well, you got prayers coming your way. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Craziest thing ever grilled, country. Vines. 
<laughs> you grill veins? <laughs> you do it that day. You do it for me. <laughs> I tell you what, I think would be good yeah, deep fried. Thank you, Zachy. Appreciate it, brother. Hey, Zach. How's everything going with you, brother? I'm sorry I didn't message you back, but I've been busy today. I've been aggravated today. Lord of mercy. Ooh. I didn't even go fishing today. I you know that's a, you know you know <laughs> you have an off day if you didn't go fishing when you got the chance. Yeah, mom. I was, <laughs> it was beautiful day today. Beautiful, especially after all that mud cat excitement we got the other day. <laughs> you was happy about that thing. Yeah, man. And you didn't catch it, but the bad thing about it, you hooked one and it got off. You got up she in the bushes. The, uh, Some in briar bushes. bushes. Right, right. At the bank. Yep. I'm trying to make it a grilled cheese on the grill. It's right off at Judy Cole's. Second time is much better. <laughs> <laughs> Grilling a grilled cheese. Cool. All right. I might, I might try that. We'll do that day. All you gotta do is get a, a metal skillet with a handle. <laughs> you you grill it right on, on the grill. I'm gonna put it on the rack. I'm gonna put it on the actual rack. Oh I'd, I'd use the skillet. I think that would be a better option. <laughs> Cheers, brother. Zach is uh, steering. Yes, sir. I'm, I'm having an A and W uh, zero sugar root beer. <laughs> drinking water. Well, I'm drinking Coca Cola and uh, Crown Apple. You never understood why it's called grilled cheese because it's not made on the grill. Ah, uh, you're right. That's good point. That's a good point. Hey, maybe somebody needs to look back into the history, and it might have been actually made on a grill back in the day. Yeah, kind of maybe it was on one. They made the first one on a blackstone grill. They did. I said maybe they did. Oh no, I don't think they had a blackstone <laughs> brand. She's about to look it up. That's the history girl. That she, she, the numbers girl. I'm thinking the dry cherry ginger ale tonight. Pretty good. That sounds pretty good. Actually, I didn't like the cherry. I don't. I like the regular ginger ale. Canada, can that's the, the, the Canada dry ginger ale is the best ginger ale of my taste. I don't like the, the flavored ones though. Uh. Early 1900s. Early 1900s. Okay. Okay. How would they prepared it? Grilled cheese yeah. history is very important. For a, for a redneck like me, yeah, it sure is. We didn't work it up to a science and got that thing right. Our ancestors got it started, and us, and us uh, today's uh, generation got it right. I had ribs. Oh, you dirty rat. Mm. <laughs> I looked at the ribs when I walked past them in the grocery store today. <laughs> I might pick some up tomorrow. She didn't say no. I'm listening. Ah. By, uh, by the time World War II was in full swing, cooks on Navy ships prepared thousands of American cheese filling sandwiches as instructed by the government issued cookbooks. But most of them was just uh, grated cheese on top of bread. By 1949, the cheese world was changed again by Kraft. And they introduced the single slices. And people started adding that second piece of cheese on it. And the grilled cheese was born. <laughs> but it don't say how. <laughs> Trail, you're right, brother. Make, hashtag make grilled cheese great again. <laughs> but when did it ever go down now? Because grilled cheese always be good in my house. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I guess you get somebody to know how to cook that thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, there's, there's a lot of stuff you don't like. Cheddar 
tiny chips. There, there were two tiny chip companies. I, I watched it on uh, when I had satellite. They had two uh, tiny chip companies competing back and forth for the war for to make the tiny chip last longer. That's how we got the tiny chips. Said it went down when he started cooking. Oh, <laughs> well, when well, it ain't the grilled cheese we need to make great again, it's your cooking skills. <laughs> 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 I reckon I'm gonna have to. Well, that ruins my other plans. I don't know. I'm gonna wait for the youngest to come over here so I can cook some stuff so they can eat the stuff. I, I won't be a bee. Hello, Kenneth. Hello. What's going on? Hello, hello. Oh, uh, y'all wouldn't want that. Y'all might not want to eat no raccoon and possums and uh Yeah, I want the big country cookbook. I think that'd be a good thing. I don't measure nothing. <laughs> I don't measure. I might have to start measuring stuff out. It ain't gonna taste right for that. But no, no, I want you to, to say it, describe it, you know, the way us Southerners do, because I, I'll understand it when you say just a pinch of this. That's flashy, you know? my Yeah, I understand my, all that lingo. <laughs> my, pinch and my pinch might be that much. Well, about, about that much of this and about that much of that. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Yeah, he's raccoon. I watched another fella on the YouTube, and uh, they was eating some raccoon stew, and it was looking good. You right up there in Columbia, yeah, right up there in Columbia South Carolina. They was, they was cooking that rabbit. I'm doing good, Mr. Uh, Kenneth. How you doing, buddy? I'm doing good, man. I'm feeling good, too. <laughs> you can't tell. <laughs> well, that got him a John Deere mower today. I, I want me, I want me a uh, zero turn. That's what I'm holding out for a zero turn. I'm trying to find one. <laughs> Reboil it a little bit. Okay. Yeah, but it's hard to make sure you get a raccoon around the south down here. Some of these, uh, these people be trying to fool you and, and be selling you a small dog. Oh. You got to be careful about that. If, if it ain't got some feet left on it that look like raccoon feet, don't eat it. It might be a small <laughs> dog. I'm not lying to you. Thank <laughs> you. Zero turn, Marvin. <laughs> Zero turn. <laughs> uh. Luke's jealous as he sees ribs. He may have tuna milk. But tuna milk sounds good to me. That sounds pretty good too. But then I can guarantee you, ain't none of that as good as what I got right over here. What you got? What you got in a jar? We got to get up to 20 viewers before I show. 20 viewers? 20 viewers before we got, we got about what? 16. You're 16 now. So. When we get to 20, I'll show and eat. Let me make a few phone calls. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. I also said if somebody <laughs> guessed, I would tell it. <laughs> and we got Mr. Luke. See, Luke already knows. <laughs> Luke already knows. Just a pig speed. He guessed it. He guessed it. I wasn't supposed to guess so Angie wouldn't have to eat it. Oh, Angie didn't want to eat it, y'all. See? I know that. Mark Mike said, oh, no. <laughs> Drink the juice. You're going to say one of them do it. Plus, you know, I got some uh these uh red sausages that I'm going to eat some of, too. Good. Drink the juice. Drink the now, juice? I like the sausages. Those things are good. I like the pickled eggs by that brand too. Ah, uh, I think you're gonna take one bite and you'll run out though. I've been pickled pickle pickle before. <laughs> been a while since I ate it. Okay, the little the lock ring broke on me. Okay, you have complications. We ain't got to eat it then. 
Oh, well, thank God I'm a redneck. I whip out my butter cutter. <laughs> Me too, Fatria. I pass on the feet. I'll eat it so y'all don't have to. There you go. Thank you, man. I, no I, I mean, you just don't know how much. <laughs> I, you can pass me one of them sausages, though. <laughs> <laughs> and that's made with chicken and pork, the sausages. Let me turn to the can go to Bojangles today, but I went. we went there the other day. Uh, we stopped, you know, when we was visiting Mom. And y'all know they got some uh, bowberry cookies there now. Me and Jan got one they had, yeah, in a two-pack, you know. <clears throat> we got one apiece. Yeah, I got the, the bowberry cookies now. You know, they had the, the bowberry biscuits, which is just a blueberry biscuit for those who don't know. So I got a blueberry cookie now, and uh, it is very good. I'm happy to announce. I, I get around to doing a review on it one day. <laughs> I want to try uh, the... Um... Yeah, if any of y'all have a Bojangles, y'all got to try that Bowberry cookie. One of my good friends and uh, viewer, uh, Kenyatta, the church's chicken, jalapeno cheddar biscuit. I haven't watched the video yet. I've seen, I seen it pop up in the feed. No, 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 they no, look no. good, man. They do look good. <laughs> jalapeno cheese honey biscuits. The honey biscuits are as good as it is usually. Yeah. Yeah. As good as the bowberry biscuit is, it's not as good as the sweetie pie for sure. <laughs> What's cheap? The bread. Well, you want to make it good, good. It's already good by itself. I'm yeah, those, good. Those, those rotisserie chicken thugs are the bomb, Luke. They are awesome. Y'all no lie, the same day Latch P was eating his rotisserie stuff. Before we know it. Country wanted a rotisserie wrap. I wanted a wrap. From Subway. Yeah. That, and I ordered it and they didn't have it. So he they, ended up they, getting a rotisserie chicken. Almost mm -hmm. the same, except for the mayonnaise. Had they got new wraps there, though. On the window, no, they they don't. New no, they don't. Not the one in Orange. The one in Orange Bear said they quit making them. Yeah, we're not they're not going to serve them no more. And we got yeah. two subways, but they're both the same family. Same people on both yeah. subways. So when I jump I, back on the sub fast next week, I'll show you what it looks like on the window. <laughs> okay. yeah, they got new wraps, is what I'm saying. It's a new chicken salad wrap, actually. Huh. I seen that. I was gonna get that. Well, you can get any uh any uh sub the regular subs in, into a wrap. Well, maybe they quit doing the regular subs and wrap and just specific ones are wraps okay. now. Yeah, so much <laughs> That's a slippery little sucker. <laughs> slippery as that. Look, Luke Jackson wants you to make a meatloaf for Angie. I know. I'll make. I'll hey, get her to make one next week. Hey, please. I don't know what. <laughs> I'm, I'm still waiting on that uh, catching catching cook with Big Country. That's what I want to see. I, I was hoping I would catch her eel the other night. Get down closer to the coast. You'll catch all the eel you want down there. All we got to do is go to the Edisto River. Man. They loaded in there. You want some bread to go with it? I'll take a scorpion. A scorpion for 200, please, Alex. <laughs> <sighs> oh, man. And I ain't but three halves. This ain't even a whole foot. This is a half a foot, really. Tough. It's, going, it's got a, it's got a capture to it now. 
Hey, 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 Jersey Mike's to Subway. Man, you can't get you can't get a bite on this thing. All the other skin, they ain't got no meat. I can't know. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. right, I finally got a broken half. And that's what it looks like. You got a couple. Of, you got a couple of fans of pickled pigs feet in the comments, eh? I can't. I, I, I can't. I can't. I can't get no meat off of it. It's all. Yeah, I like the pork rinds too, but this ain't how I remember pickled pig feet. This the southern snack ain't no southern snacks with no pig feet. It don't even feel like the texture. Don't even feel like it's doing. No. And it is hair on it right there. I didn't have no hair on mine. I feel it. All right, that's a pass for me. I guess we ain't that country, country. No. I'm, I'm, that. Yeah, pork rinds are good. Uh, I used to like the um. I like the um. Salt vinegar. Yeah, but I like the. No, the. The little crunchy ones. The. You can't watch. Ranch, yeah. Best live show ever. <laughs> Yo. The hairs help us slide down your throat. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have spiders in there. Worms and everything else again, but it's like happening. Right, they, 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 they need to eat. No, Luke, you don't. The hair helps it slide down your throat. <laughs> <laughs> Fishbowl margarita. We 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 are, this is an adult channel. Oh yeah, I forgot to say this is an adult channel. If your children, please don't watch this channel. 
<laughs> Please don't watch this channel. <laughs> Interesting to go to the place and find it. Was it delicious? Oh. This is yeah, pretty good. Eat with a little bread. Yeah, um, uh, I think we have got this place called Drizzly. Drizzly was to deliver your alcohol to your dough. Oh, really? Some, some um, tequila and some margarita mix and mix them together. I don't know how to make a margarita. I do a red dip margarita. Oh, uh, come on. <laughs> That's good. It's real good there. I love them. And yet too too pleased with the pickle peak peak. I'm gonna try a different, but I'm gonna try to find a different brand. We do have uh, um, two water burgers coming to the Columbia area. One this this summer, and one this fall. The actual water burger chain. That'd be interesting. Not the water burger that we already have. It's a the national chain. Yeah, yeah the national chain is coming. I can't wait. Well, it ain't gonna make a difference to me. I'd rather go in there and get one of the night crawlers out the bait cup. Yeah, you're right, bro. What? Go ahead. You want me to get it? Don't, don't. I don't know what they put on. Let's see how they do it. Hey, don't take it. I'll, fry it. I'll, I'll saute them butter for you. You ever, you ever read that book called How to Eat Fried Worms? Yeah, that's an old book. Mm -hmm. We about to uh, Angie about to show us how to do it. Oh no, Angie! Ain't <laughs> <laughs> you probably could get one in now before you get that mm -hmm. now. I don't know why they put it in big cups. That's oh, thank y'all. Oh, it just hit y'all. No, no, sorry. Excuse Red me, y'all. Crackers, cream cheese with pepper jelly. That sounds pretty good, actually, to me. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just... All right, just shout again. Shout them up. Oh, yeah, here it goes again. <laughs> mm. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, Luke Jackson wants to know an easier way to peel his bold eggs. Angie, that's, that's, a, that's, that's something you could probably help him with. How to ball? How do I do it, honey? I, I, I'll you take it? Fast, it? No, you just. Well, I don't know. You, I, I'll just stick it in my hand and roll it around until it gets all. No. I did not. Got a bowl of egg first, Luke. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Got a hard ball of first. Yeah. Got a hard ball of first. You right? She got you on that one. Mm. <laughs> she got you, Luke. She got you. <laughs> Now got it. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, you hard ball them and then um. You yeah, you don't have to take that, Luke. Use the force. Wrong, Luke. Yeah, I I said that. You know, that's what I thought. I ain't balled them in a while. I never, I have never eaten a raw egg. I I, I wouldn't recommend it. That's what I forgot. Fresh the egg, harder to peel. $35 for a three point five gallon bucket. Yeah, lots of salt will yeah, the salt will help the um the shell peel off. Yeah. I never heard that one then either. Now which way homemade deviled eggs are real good. They float, yep. If they float or they sink their pressure. I can't remember. <coughs> Thank y'all. Y'all 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 brought something back to my memory. So I was trying to think about earlier. That's what it was about the uh, 
a bucket. That's a good bread right there. How much made sugar cookies? So good. They are. They got an Amish bakery in the town down the two towns down the road. I don't like Oreos. Yeah, Angie don't like Oreos. Good. But you like them. The Oreo cakes. I ain't tried those. They look that, good. That, that feeling, you know, it's not so sweet. That feeling, oh, that thing is it's good. Not, it's not very sweet, sweet. I like that. Marcel says she used to eat raw eggs and white rice with some soy sauce. It's a Japanese thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That, 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 probably, that sounds pretty good there. Yeah. yeah. I probably would like to fry it, like maybe over the sunny side up, like and that. then crack the yolk in it. You get the white. I like to do the egg drop soup. She loves to do egg drop you soup. You just stir the water and the seasonings, have it going around a circle, and then you use a strainer and you pour the egg through the strainer and it it goes off in like little noodles. All right. Somebody wants to know, Big Country, do you got any funny stories ordering at the drive through? Oh, that's my good bag one. <laughs> one. He said one time they had a black kid working at McDonald's drive through here. I wow. Oh, 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 mm, oh. Yeah. Yeah, you can't say what race said. They had a black kid working at McDonald's drive through here. Yeah. No, what? Okay. He's probably working it better than some of these around him. Yeah, he's probably right. That'd be the one time they get my order right. Exactly, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Luke is something now. He's something all right. <laughs> that bread tastes pretty good, man. Y'all got me wanting to eat now. I got Dad wants a carrot cake with some cream cheese. Ice. Oh, freak me. Yes, that's right. All right, there. There, time I gave him twenty dollar bill, he gave fifty and change. Michelle Davenport says, "Watch your favorite video game." I'm a Fortnite girl. I like okay, World of Warcraft, Fortnite. Michelle. <clears throat> but I'd like to try Fortnite sometime. I've never played it. I never played it. I did, I I never liked the look of it. I never liked the. No, I could, I could, I, that, that's one of the games I probably could not get into. It took me almost a year and a half to get into. Uh, World of Warcraft. We're still, working, we're still working on that. <laughs> uh, had a lot going on this week. I couldn't really mess with it much. Well, I had some stuff going on too, trying to get the boat. The boat back going. Not back going, going. Shell Davenport says Fortnite is fun. We ain't, we ain't beyond trying it out, though. I'd like to try it out. I might would try it out. I might. Try they got out. some interesting looking characters on there for sure. Yeah, no, he plays. Thirty John said I ordered food on my basket and wants a bird king. And they, when I went to pay, they told oh, me he, I could, they wouldn't serve it to me. So what else? He ordered. He went through drive through and basket. We have people walking around here what? through the Shit, drive through on um. They walk. Walking. They walk through the drive through. Yep, I, I've, had, I've had people walk through the drive through. Like, not me, him. I've seen people walk through the drive through up there in Denmark. Mm -hmm. Me and thieves. Now, I'm going to show you what these things. Yeah. <laughs> you need to pay a pet for a reason. Oh, yeah. I can go to walk a dog girl. I mean, pick a wig. Okay, he's actually going to be gaming soon. Getting his gaming set up soon. On uh, what? What? PC? Console? What? 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 Looks so good. Yep. <laughs> it tastes good except for the chocolate. Zach says we will go head to head, y'all. Oh, yeah. You're going to lose, brother. <laughs> this is. 
Tell them about the first time somebody threw down a duel on you on World of Warcraft. You didn't realize what was going on. <laughs> I was walking down the path and somebody just threw me. Out. Zingers. I like all them hostess cakes, man. Most of them are pretty good. A Luther burger. No. Well, we know what you were saying, Miss Michelle. We we knew what you were saying. <laughs> What's a Luther burger? A Luther burger. Thirty drums. It's a Luther burger. I ain't never heard of that. Where you at? Spread them. You may have to look it up. You make them every 4th of July. I'll look it up. Mm -hmm. I, I would eat the other pack, but I got to save that pack. I was going to save that pack. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I didn't got me a mix right now. That's not a mixed drink. That's an adult energy drink. <laughs> it's an adult energy mixed drink. It's mixed. The kind, the, the kind that takes your energy down. <laughs> I don't know. Give me energy, brother. I'm energized. <laughs> I might not be able to hang with this country tonight. <laughs> so you going to have a tummy ache. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll cross that bridge when it comes to it in the morning. Krispy Kreme donuts. Oh, it's a burger made with a donut as the bun. Chicken sandwich. I done that with a chicken sandwich. I wanted the food hacks. <laughs> Y'all don't know what that is. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me do this right. There we go. Y'all see I that? I meant the peanut. All right. Thing. Yeah. I am still working on the design for my shirts and hoodies and whatnot merch. Okay, we'll eat that some cheese tomorrow. No, because hmm? no, I don't have a Krispy Kreme and Orange Bird. Yeah, we see where they're gonna do the Krispy Kreme at McDonald's. Yeah, I don't. I, I'm not. I'm not loving that. <laughs> nope. Uh, 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 I'm not loving it. Mm, 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 not loving it. Hey, peanut. Uh oh, this is interesting. Hi. So are they gonna make them on site at McDonald's too, or are they just gonna oh yeah, sell yeah. What's, what's been delivered? Can y'all see Kaya? She's sniffing it. She's sniffing the Bigfoot. You want it? You can have it. You want it? Come on. She's like, nah. I don't know about that. Yeah. Yeah. Baby, glad Oscar ain't there. He'd eat that. No, thing. I, I look into that, Michelle. Oscar, tear it up. I like this. I like the zip up hoodies myself. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Hey, don't get him on the bed now. Nope. She's eating it, y'all. So she's licking it. I didn't know Bojangles had pulled pork. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. Nope. She didn't spit it out. She don't like it. Don't give it to her. <laughs> nah, you ain't getting it. The dog didn't care for the, the pickle pig. She wanted to eat it, but she don't want it. I'll, I'll look into 
put the zipper in the hoodie when we start doing it there. Why well, I'm supposed to loosen it up. What you mean? Why well, I'm supposed to look it up something. I'm pretty sure the way I'm going to do it is down, down on the side, you go in and tell them what size you want, and then they'll print the, the, uh, the design on the shirt and then send it to y'all. Pulled pork on bone jangles. Yeah, I didn't know they had it there. I didn't know. I didn't know that either. Okay, yeah. yeah. I'll yeah, ever there is And that little dog right there loves zebra cakes. She will fight you for a zebra cake. Them pork, red hot sauce, and all so good. With a Luther burger. Oh, okay. I, I imagine it would be good with a Luther oh, okay. burger. Oh, there was a piece on the floor she fell. The field. You can cut the light, bright light off. Yeah, I can turn the light down. I'm going to dim the light, y'all. There we go. That's better. What is the best fast food chicken sandwich? Ooh, oh, that's that's a good one there. Ah, right, time. Want to help me out with this one? Depends on <clears throat> who, where you, you got in your hand at the time. <laughs> Uh, Bojangles hey, for me uh, has to be the Bojangles. Bojangles has a darn good chicken sandwich. But also, Zach's but there's a lot of people that, that don't get that chicken sandwich either. I like it better than Popeye's chicken sandwich. It's, it's hard for me, but it's hard for me because I like Bojangles. I like Zaxby's. Um, yeah, now you know. Now, now that's something else too. Zaxby's has a daggone good chicken sandwich as well. They do. And so does Hardy's. Hardy's has a good chicken sandwich. I'd have to place, uh, with all the choices we got, I'd have to place Popeye's fourth. Popeye's, yeah. Yeah. KFC chicken sandwich is the best. Okay. No, uh, no. No, I, I, I disagree with that. It, it might be in Ohio, but down in the south, though, it, 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 it's pretty lame old. What is <laughs> The the uh, KFC. K, uh the KFC chicken sandwich. <laughs> I don't like I, I don't like KFC. Right. We have breakfast. Huh? I won't get one. The Chick Fil A it has a pretty good sandwich. I yeah, Chick Fil A's got a good chicken sandwich. I I won't. Now that they're switching over from organic. To steroid chicken, and their chicken's gonna go downhill. Just we'll see. If they, if they brown it right, you won't be able to tell the difference. The hell you say? If they brown it right, you won't be able to tell. The hell you say? <laughs> My taste bud knows the difference. <laughs> if she go in the kitchen, she can cook two. two. My taste bud to know the difference between the two. Mm -hmm. I got good taste bud. They uh, they unique. They saw. <laughs> well, why don't you why don't you eat that bag on the uh, oops uh dip over there then? That thing tastes like polished cheese. And, well, it tastes better than the cheese dip. Yeah. Or sodium. You are too. I'm thinking about getting me a fig bar. Y'all, I didn't eat no supper tonight. I didn't eat no supper. I eat lunch. When I eat lunch, I eat Chinese food. Anything you eat with the name Zach. It's good. <laughs> Ster steroid chicken sandwich. <laughs> well, it's all right. Zach's is all right, but Zach, 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 ZC might not be all right. Well, how many of the others are already selling those type of chicken sandwiches anyway? Are they all selling organic chicken? I don't, I don't think they are. No, no, no. But I'm just saying, I, could, I, 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 I probably could tell the difference. I already get. Y'all yeah. excuse me, I ain't eating no supper tonight, so I'm eating this and these, 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 these devil hate that I ain't supposed to be eating. I think it's the reason they're doing it then is because uh, something to do with the oh. being able to offer, offer the customer a lower cost. That, that's what you're saying, yeah. Yeah. I mean, well, you know, crap is just too high, you know. <laughs> just, 
What Just about that? Your mother? Back on high. What's your favorite chicken? I just, I just I just hope when they do offer the lower cost, the chicken sandwich don't shrink, you know, yeah. like everything else. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know about the uh spicy chicken nuggets for Wendy's now. Y'all see how much you get a pack of chips ahoy cookies now, how much the cookies don't shrink. About, oh, yeah, you know, about as big as an Oreo. When I grew up, you grab a pack of chips ahoy, you had to almost yeah. get two hands around that pack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Michelle, right? Chicken wings over the nuggets or something. Yes, Dustin. Quincy's was awesome, and I missed it so yeah. much. That yeah. we, we, there's actually one still left in South Carolina. Believe it or not. Supposedly, we don't know. We're gonna go find out. <laughs> Me and Big Country want to take that trip together. <laughs> but Tom, when I make my trip to Bucky's, Denise rolls No, no, no. I still remember. I'm a <laughs> yeah, well, I'll I'll meet you at the Quincy's because I want to hit that buffet. Hey, I, I never been. I never been to Quincy's. Mm, man, because, because when I was old enough to get ready to go out on my own, that was done cold down up there in Ironbury. Quincy started off as just a pure steakhouse. Mm-hmm. Yep. No bonus wings ain't wings, they're chicken tenders. But but Quince's was the first one to have the buffet above Ryan's and then mm-hmm. chicken tender or chicken nugget. You're right, Michelle. It might could be considered a chicken nugget. Ryan's copied them and then Golden Corral copied both of them. Yep. 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 Long, 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 long. Quince's yes, was please. also the first one to have the big fat yeast roll and they had the commercial. Delicious. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I still remember them. You know, I, I missed out on the Quiznos subs. I missed out when they were hot. But man, they went downhill fast, didn't they? Have we ever had Quiznos? I ain't never ate Quiznos. I ain't never heard of I've never heard of it. Yeah, they they just about no Quiznos left. I don't think there's no Ryan's left either. Nope, no Ryan's. Ain't, there. ain't any Golden Crowns left. Cool. I, I I was thinking about going tomorrow, but uh, it's something that uh, Arby's I want to try. Yeah, I remember Ponderosa, Bonanza, Western Sizzling. What's that, Tom? Dustin, he's naming off some old steakhouses from back in the day. Ponderosa. Well, we had a Ponderosa up here in uh, Nieces. But it was a it was a bar. Oh, juke joint. And and surprisingly, they're starting to fix it up again for the fourth or fifth time. And it's not I forgot what they named it last time, but I think they're gonna open up another bar there in Nieces. Might be a, a club or something. I don't know. Might be one of them X rated clubs. We still got a few golden corrals left here, Zach. Yep. Mm-hmm. I think there's one in Columbia. West Columbia. There's one in Spartanburg. Yes, Dustin, I remember Po folks, man. Po folks, awesome. <laughs> folks was look at the camera, you'll see Po folks. Dustin, you from South? You from the South, man? <laughs> you from down here? Po folks was amazing. What's the buffet? Going corral up down Forest Drive in Columbia. Yeah. Uh, I couldn't tell you what road it on. I can, I can, I can take you there though. Uh, uh, five seventy seven. Yeah, off five seventy seven. You take a left and go down there. It's mm-hmm. on the left. Mm-hmm. Right before you get to um, one of the places down there. Old country buffet. 
a minute cheese on your burger, yeah. That um, if y'all go back and look at uh, um, our messy burger from Christie's that had homemade pimento cheese. Homemade, the, that's the best homemade pimento cheese I've tried. And it was good. Angie don't like pimento cheese, and it was good on there. Yeah, Angie. Morrison's, Morrison's cafeteria. Yep, I remember that one too. <laughs> Now they got the mall, the Prince of Orange Mall up here in Orangeburg, and they said they got some pretty good Chinese food in there. Ooh, excuse me, y'all. We got a mall up in Greenville. It's called Haywood Mall. They still got the Sabaros Pizza and stuff like that in there from like back in the day. There's not many of those left either. I don't know if they got the GNC in this mall still. They used to have that. You talking about for the vitamins and stuff? Yeah, yeah. We got GNC stores, you know, like in places like Simpsonville, but they'll be like in, in one of many strip mall things now, no, you know. Yeah. But yeah, you can still go to those. But they don't, I, I don't know. Some of the malls might still have. Yeah, y'all go to Columbiana Mall. That's would be a close one to y'all. I could think of that was a big one. I ain't never been there. You never been to the Columbia? I've been there. It's been years ago, though. Well, I'll take that back. I may have been there years ago. Somebody freaked out on the elevator. To my sister? Oh, that damn fool won't even go across the daggone bridge. She been freaking out. I won't go with her to the ocean. I wouldn't go. We wouldn't go to the beach together. She had driving on. I like the collard greens that this old couple makes. They run a country store in the middle of nowhere. And you make the best collard green man. <laughs> <laughs> Two thumbs up on that, and I can I can contest to that. They're just yeah, right. church family too. There's <laughs> one fella at church. His old lady won't cook no collard greens for her. My wife, I told her she can't cook no collard greens for him, but if she's cooking collard greens, and he's he happy to be at that. church, he can have some collard greens. <laughs> okay, she moved out. Of, okay. I don't like sugar. You like sugar in your collard greens there. I don't like sugar. In I and like them sweet. Then they, they, they take it away from the flavor. A lot yeah. of My mama would put uh, sugar in the collars. And I, I didn't <laughs> like that. Eating out is very expensive. I hope you show us some of your homemade recipes. Homemade recipes are very expensive too, buddy. Hell yeah. Well, they're a little bit less expensive because if you buy, if you're going to be cooking a bunch of recipes that have similar ingredients, like flour, a bag of flour, and then some uh, some cornstarch. There's one of the starch in the, not cornstarch. It's uh, some other kind of starch. I had to watch the video again. It's, the lady said it's better than cornstarch. It's better than the tempu powder she makes. It's be, it, it makes your food really crispy. I said, I got to get some of that. I like crispy food. <laughs> if you're eating that, Taco Bell is very affordable. <laughs> no. I won't eat that. <laughs> I, ain't hey, never, I hey, would. Whether you eat there or not, you can't deny it. it's very I affordable. I will never go back to Taco Bell ever again. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'll lie dead in the street before I go back. <sighs> My wife makes coffee not like well, that. I like it. Now I especially like them prices. <laughs> yeah. I didn't care for it, especially that rice and cheesy uh, stuff. Nah. Uh, shoot, I love uh, Janice even likes them, man. We got that today. I, 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 got, I, I, got, I, got, I got us four burritos for six bucks. And, and well, that, that, water. According to what you order, yeah, you can get a good price on stuff, but I don't like the flavor of the stuff. I don't like the flavor of it. Well, they got that chipotle on there. That's probably what you don't like. The what? The Chipotle that's on the I love cheesy Chipotle. rice and bean. Well, that's I what's on the cheesy rice and bean burrito. That's but I don't, what's like, I don't like the cheesy rice. That's the part. I don't like the rice and the cheese. Oh, okay. All that yeah. mixed together, it just don't. It don't. For me, it don't mesh well together. I'm not saying it's not good for you. Just like I like, well, I like uh, pickle uh, sausage. She don't like pickle sausage. It's just. The, the menu is extensive, man. I mean, there's so much to try at Taco Bell. Uh, if if I had to recommend anything to you when they come back around, try those. Uh, they're loaded uh, fries. They actually got some good fries. You know, they 
do them up yeah. with the chili and the cheese and everything. They make a good loaded French fry. It's a little bit different than their normal menu, though. <laughs> yeah, Taco Bell breakfast. Their their breakfast is good. I I, I do enjoy that too. Especially, I can get that one dollar. The egg and the egg and cheese potato or the egg and cheese sausage. They're a dollar a piece. I mean, that price is unheard of anywhere. Well, you can get a bunch of them and get full on them, but I might. I haven't tried them, but I, I don't know if I would like them. You probably like the breakfast. It's 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 just basically just like a breakfast wrap mainly. Well, I, if you I, like I, the ones at Sonic and stuff I, like that, you like their their breakfast wrap. I don't like Sonic breakfast. I don't like breakfast wraps. I don't like egg on a wrap. You ate that one the other day at Hardy's. <laughs> That was the chicken wrap. I didn't eat the, the breakfast. No, you had the croissant, nope. egg and cheese croissant thing at the party. No, that was, that, morning. I, that can, I can make a buffalo chicken dip. I can actually make that homemade. Make a video, post it so we can see it. I want to <laughs> see that. I was about to say something about that a while ago, but uh, what uh, that was that was the loaded. Brie, uh, loaded uh, omelet biscuit. Oh. Yeah, a loaded omelet biscuit. So much squash in the oven, sliced thin with breadcrumbs to cook it. Crock pot recipes. Crock pot. Oh, some homemade beef stew. Yep, yep. Oh, dang. Well, <clears throat> my crock pot is instant pot, but yeah. Well, we got a crock pot. We got a crock pot. Mortal yeah. says all fast food makes a wish she cooked it itself. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah. I agree on that. The only thing I like, I like the fries at a lot of restaurants. I got sweet potato tots, which are awesome, dipped in Duke's mayonnaise. Awesome. When I make my buffalo chicken dip, I cheat. I get one of those rotisseries at the grocery store already cooked up. <laughs> and I just pull pull the chicken off of it. Uh, you get, well, I like to shred my own sharp cheddar. Mm-hmm. And, and you get a bottle of ranch and a bottle of uh, Frank's Red Hot buffalo sauce, uh, some cream cheese. You melt the cream cheese and mix the buffalo and the ranch together. You know where it's got a thick consistency. Then you uh, put in the chicken and you put in the... Uh, shredded cheddar and you got to get that blue cheese too you got to get that blue cheese and it goes on the top and then you bake it with some more cheddar lining the top with the blue cheese mixed in with it you bake it and then that's your buffalo chicken dip in a nutshell i'd have to actually make it and do the recipe online to show you but it's really good (laughs) that's crazy I think Tom will get some, uh, uh, Subway. Yeah. Pizza. I don't get Subway and I don't get Hardy's. Don't we, can't, we get it. Um, Domino's Pizza. Oh, Papa John's. Papa John's. Yeah. And Domino's. And that don't be no uh, deal. Really. That don't be no deal. It'd be regular price stuff. It just makes it look like it's a good deal. It ain't yeah. a good deal. Yeah, you, you can leave the blue cheese out if you want to, but it yeah, would be I don't a like mistake to leave it out. <laughs> Don't care for you Lisa's Country Kitchen, New Market makes the best sweet potato casserole. Sweet. Last meal. Did you not see the pickle pig feet? <laughs> Who tried to eat? Oh, no, I think they asked him the last meal if you get have one last meal before you die. He asked that morbid stuff before. Yeah, he? we don't do the morbid kind of stuff. Now. Oh, I don't like I don't like blue cheese either. It, it, I've tried it in the past. I put it in my mouth and about to throw it up. Frog legs. Yep. Frog Top legs. Top five fast food restaurants. Well, number one had to be Wendy's, Hardy's. Are we talking commercial or can we throw in like the local fast food? We got local oh, fast food yeah. restaurants right here. Yeah. Uh. I think you're just talking about the. Cause we got like we got like chain restaurants that just 
or in the upstate of South Carolina that Big Country mm-hmm. don't even have them down his way, and they've got stuff down that way that we don't have up here. But you can go from county to county in the upstate and find restaurants yeah. like Carolina Fine Food everywhere. And they sell like the best chili cheeseburgers and hot dogs and <laughs> you name it. You get stuff like fried chicken livers there. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Commercial. Commercial. So that's just like big, big names. names. So that was like I was saying, Wendy's, Hardy's, both Dangles. Yes, ma'am. And What's that other one that sells chicken? <laughs> Chick fil A? No. Churches? No. Bojangle? No. Zaxby's. And then, Zaxby's. uh, then, uh, then, uh, 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 uh churches. Not far from there. Yeah, they got some. They got some fried chicken livers here, Michelle, at different restaurants that are just amazing. See, we up there. They sell some good chicken livers. So it was good. It was good last time. I don't eat chicken liver. I fish with it, but I won't eat it. We should have had some uh, chicken livers the other night. We might have got a catfish. We might have. Might have. <laughs> or an eel. Man. Did any, of y'all, did any of y'all watch details? We didn't see nothing happen around here. We was, we was, when we filmed that um, Fates Old River, we was out there. We ain't see no change in the sky. Scaring me, boss. If the Linguini or Fredo had chicken in it, I'd go with it. <laughs> my, my, my spaghetti and meatballs. My spaghetti with her meatballs. I make one heck of spaghetti. You make one heck, some heck of a meatballs. If I would make Baked spaghetti, you know, is I'd have to go watch yeah. The, the video again, right? I'd have to watch no, the video. To, I know you would see have to see how to cook. I, you tell me how to cook and not cook it. It probably come out perfect. Mm-hmm. Baked spaghetti. Yeah, it was my spaghetti baked. Because I put all the, the peppers and the onions and the, the foot cheese and the uh, olives, mushroom. olives, mushrooms, peppers. Sometimes I, I've been thinking about putting some jalapeno in there and maybe some ghost peppers. Maybe the cheddar on the reaper. Baked spaghetti is awesome, though. It really is. We had it today, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not holding you, honey. You got to get over to mom. She got to cover. Come on. Come on. Big country, you and Angie ever tried that brazier shrimp dip? They've got that down y'all's way. You ever tried the shrimp dip? Mm-mm, I don't eat shrimp. I can't eat shrimps. Oh, that's right. You don't like shrimp. I forget. No, I can't eat them. I like them. I can't eat them. They don't like me. Yeah. <laughs> okay, she said she's going to let me eat some shrimp on, on camera. I ain't being responsible. She said, she, I, I, well, if I can't just eat one. If I'm going to eat shrimps, I'm going to eat about. 20 or 30. Shrimp, not scrimps. Scrimps, 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 scrimps. Just like Miss Michelle saying, blue crabs and scrimps. I want to go catch me some blue crabs. Off the coast of South Carolina. <laughs> so, throw my cat's net out there in that breakfast water, catch me some scrimp. I caught something like that, and I was, I was, I, I had to get somebody else to put it on the hook so I could fish with it. Yeah, if they're going to make you have an allergic reaction, don't eat them, buddy. Then I just go to high. I'll be outside the hospital when I eat them. I literally get in the parking lot at the hospital when I eat them. No, he, I I eat them. I, no, he, <laughs> the way they mismanage people like my mom here lately, I wouldn't try it, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> when I just gave me some liquid Benadryl, <laughs> and drink the whole bottle. You, you might need to know. borrow somebody's EpiPen. You be like on that movie where he sweat up. We don't, we, don't, we don't watch movies with him no more. But I know the movie we're talking about. Chew off a bit of drill, Dustin say. <laughs> I, I get to lick with children's bit of drill because that wasn't pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I imagine so. Crabbing on the Chesapeake Bay. And me and Angie and uh, a fellow we call Snake, uh, he went with us. And uh, we went down there to, uh, around the town of Yamasee, South Carolina. It has a wreckage water, which is a good place to catch some the blue crabs. And uh, I don't know what kind of little bugs got a hold of Angie. Something got a hold of her. And uh, she had like a rash for like two weeks. That's why Angie ain't to go back. Fried whole crabs. The soft shell ones, yeah. Mm-hmm. I know you can fry the, uh, the soft shell ones. The mm-hmm. hard shell ones, I, I wouldn't recommend that. Shrimp <laughs> with the cocktail sauce. Yes. Yes, they did. I got a little bit, but I, I ain't really allergic to uh, uh, bug bites like, like she is. Because if I get like red bugs or chiggers or something like that, I throw some rubbing alcohol on them in the day. They're gone. Huh? They multiply and spread <laughs> very, very, very badly. I'll sweet you sour. I do they call his name. Oh, uh, that's just because uh, uh, his name, well, because of his name, we, we there's a wrestler called Jake the Snake Roberts. And uh, we just called him. His name's Jake, so we call him Jake the Snake. Yep. But that, 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 that's the only reason. And them little snakes, they, they, they work. I'm still hungry. I told you, uh, you're drinking. Yeah, but I'm still hungry. WrestleMania was... Last week, I I don't watch it no more. I don't watch wrestling no more. And it got too uh too talkative for me. Oh, let's talk more action. Let's talk more action. Yeah. My mama I'm sat there and watch wrestling. It, 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 the show ain't number an hour long. You got four to five minutes of people running the mouth and they're going one match. When they destroyed kayfabe and wrestling, they they just they just ruined it. I'm not holding you. Mm-hmm. Nope. Favorite is the Undertaker. Huh? No, this is What time is it? Undertaker. I used to like the Undertaker. Uh-huh. Yep. Yeah. I used to like old uh, Stone Cold Steve Boston. Should have seen what the Undertaker did to the Rock. It was awesome. Well, last, last week? Man. Oh, I would love to see the Rock get his butt whooped. <laughs> I guess he smelled I guess, I guess uh, the Undertaker didn't smell what the Rock was cooking. <laughs> Legend killer Randy Orton. <laughs> nee. Nee. Started watching when Sting and Ultimate Warrior was popular. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm not holding you. No, I'm not. I'm not holding you. She wants a um a fig. God bless y'all. Yeah, I didn't care for JBL. Hex off. Good mom. Carlito. How about Carlito then, BC? <laughs> mm, nah. Nah. <laughs> Now, I like old Eddie Guerrero now. He, he was a pretty good wrestler. My favorite was Hornswoggle. Hornswoggle. <laughs> Seamus. <laughs> Hornswoggle. Hornswoggle. 
Dude, love now. Right there, you go now. There you go. Taking pain with the spirits, duo. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't nothing but a bunch of acting. Bunch of acting. Bunch of overpaid actors to run around in some tights. <laughs> now listen, y'all. My favorite two for real was the Legion of Doom, the Road Warriors. Nobody could get in the ring, and take those guys back in the day. Yeah, I remember the Bushwhackers. Uh, very, very little bit. Ain't that the one that ran around the ring? The hand going around. I'm not holding you. Get up there with the cover. Get over there. Nope. Lay down. Yeah, me too. I love the Road Warriors. Greatest tag team of all time. I'm not holding you. No. The boss man. British Bulldog. RVD. Mr. Perfect. Road Warrior. We watch a lot of wrestling from the 80s and early 90s, and I'm cooked. Okay. <laughs> all right, we, is we just talking about WCW, or are we talking about the ECW and all the other ones, too? We're talking about all of them. Well, the same man, the same man, ECW. And go all, Dust, Dustin Rhodes. Yeah. Go Dust. Can't stand a million dollar man. I remember him, <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Perfect. <laughs> to be the man, you got to beat the man. Woo! Rick, Rick Flair was ultimate. I mean, he was he was a legendary heel wrestler. You know, he was a legendary heel wrestler. Uh, his, he spent his whole career being the bad guy and champion at the same time. Thinking about that. Yep. <laughs> Macho man. Oh, yeah. Well, this will be her dog, but I got to hold it. That's your baby. You know it. Oh. Haku. <laughs> the, Haku and the Barbarian both. They uh they spent their entire careers, you know, putting other wrestlers over, but they were legit badasses in real life, they say. Every wrestler vouches for it. Yeah, Warlord. Oh, I'm trying to think of his name. I can see him in my mind. I can't get his name out of my head. The one that uh, Stone Cold used to beat up a lot. <laughs> his enemy he, his own. he beat up a lot of people. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Desmond Man, Shane Man. <laughs> you got to be more specific then. <laughs> <laughs> oh. what, is, what do you look like? Ball head, uh, um, gold medalist, uh, Kurt Angle. Kurt Angle, yeah. Yep, the angle cutter. Stop ah. time. She trying to bug you up for that. Uh, I know what she wants, but she ain't mm -hmm. giving. Um, I can't think of his name. You know who else they say was a legit badass, and that was uh, Harley Race. They said even Andre the Giant was afraid of Harley Race. <laughs> mm. I do like the Undertaker a lot because he, uh, yeah.
Oh, okay. Okay. Appreciate that. Yeah, appreciate it. Just keeping it real. That's all we try to do. Stay, stay 100% honest. Oh, yeah. Can't think of the name. Uh, Describing. I hate when you draw a blank. It was that one that daggone went crazy and uh, up his family. Oh, Chris Benoit. Yeah, Chris Benoit. Before, yeah, he was a pretty good. Uh, yeah, he was a great wrestler. They say a, a lot of that was due to brain injury that he sustained yep. from mm-hmm. taking the hit butts so much off of the ring rope. Yep. Yep, that, that was, I liked him as a wrestler a long time. And I still haven't got my WWE 2023 yet. Oh, you're going to get that game? I was thinking about getting it, but I'm thinking about getting 2024 because it's available now, please. I see one wrestling game they they be playing on YouTube all the time where you could get any of the wrestlers from the past or create them yep. if you need to or whatever. I see, I see one like that that everybody plays. Mankind, yeah. I like all his characters. <laughs> I like his character as Cactus Jack better than I did Man King. Yep. He come out there. <laughs> Jerry Lawler. Jerry Lawler. He's a loud mouth. Can't think of her name, but it was Bianca something. Who? A wrestler. Bianca. Her first name was Bianca. We we'll got some more from going cast deposit. And send you ten dollars from. Let me see. Hold on, yo. Um, mm. Let me see. Uh, do you have a smoker? Yes and no. I rigged it so that it would be a smoker. I have one. Uh, Mine's a wood smoker, oak wood. And- I got I got a pellet grill. It'll smoke anything you need that want to be sick. It sure will. It, it, it's a real good one. Mine's a, uh mine's basically a big old pit with wheels under it. Did you go? Big Country's is awesome. His is homemade. You got to do a video on it and show him what you did one day. I did Welcome make back. it. I, I bought it. I, I spent six hundred on it. Did you? Well, I ain't never seen another one like it. It's, it's I have, unique. I have seen one exactly looks exactly like it could be a switch. I thought somebody went out there and stole it. Matter of fact, <laughs> was it in the yard the other day. <laughs> Where'd you see that? <laughs> Thank, you, yeah. Thank you, Brandon. The donation. Still on there. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't get a notification. My phone is ain't stupid because it turned the volume off, and I didn't get the notification. Thank you. And there was another one too, ain't it? I think so. She was a wrestler mania last week. She's awesome. From Thompsonville, love the videos. Thompsonville, Georgia. Georgia. Brandon, thank you. Yes. No, it's just one. Okay. Yeah. Anyone know? Uh, Oh, no, okay, that was Brandon right there. Mm-hmm. Okay. There was this one because there was an email and there was a, yeah, sure. She was on WrestleMania last weekend. That's what I was waiting to look up. Uh, who was it? Bianca. Bianca. They have a Ninja Woodfire outdoor world that smoke. I love it. Smoking pork. But the oh, you have one of the, I looked at one of those today at Target. I looked at, at Ninja Woodfire. We looked at one that was like yours, 
for six hundred and something dollars, right? Uh huh. And then there was one for four hundred something dollars that was bigger than that. Yeah, yeah. I the one that's yeah, bigger was gonna be. But was it a pit boss? Yep. Yep. Both ones like pit boss. I don't know. I'd have jumped on it though. Uh yeah. I should have. I was that close, but I'm still yeah. trying to get stuff for the boat. So. At Lowe's right now, they got one like mine, except for it's an updated model. The hopper and all looks different, but the same size. But the hopper looks different for the wood pellets. Mm. And it was 500 and some. So they're coming down a little bit in price. Bianca. The Bianca. Mm-hmm. Bianca. WWE. Anyone know Charlie Crop yet? Bianca Blair? Uh, a singer, Charlie Crockett. Charlie Crockett's a country singer. Yeah, that was it. Yeah, the Blair. Okay. I don't like watching the female wrestlers. I don't know why, especially that there's, there's, there's certain ones that I can't stand. Okay. But uh, there's one, uh, I don't know if she's a, still a wrestler. AJ, I think that's her name, ain't it? Oh, I don't know. Doesn't know. Get up on the cover. WWE female wrestler. Nope. She don't want me. She don't want me. Okay. She don't want me. Now, China. Oh, she was crazy. China. China was a pretty cool wrestler, though. And she, and she I, I, didn't I, have anybody to wrestle back in the day. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so I'm, I'm saying, she, she didn't have to compete with female wrestlers. She had to compete with the male wrestlers. She beat Jeff Jarrett and won the Intercontinental Championship. I think she's the only female wrestler to win one of the male belts, too, isn't she? Yeah, I think so. But didn't she die from a heart attack or something? Yeah, she got bad off on the drug just to... Oh, oh. I didn't know that. She got into that pornography scene for a while. Yeah, she died in Got me looking up, Dagmar. <laughs> Charlotte Flair, <laughs> Rick Flair's daughter. She's riding her daddy coattails. He named her after the Charlotte, North Carolina. Named her after the city up there. Mm hmm. I have to walk the dogs. Thanks for showing up, Michelle. Yep. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank Come you. back again. Yep. Yep. All right. So what's the plans for the weeks? My week? I don't mind. I got no plans for it. You gonna take the new build out any this week? You got that ready? Not quite. I still got. I'm debating if I want to try to put it in water one more time. And is it still, 
if the motor will pee. If it won't pee, I have to, I have to rebuild the uh, water pump. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> well, you have to bring back memories about what I'm trying to dang and think about today. We thought about we probably go fishing sometime this week. Probably to look like I don't know. We might go on the big boat. Got the trolling motor. Trolling motor was good. Well, uh, if you need help with the rebuilding that thing, that is a done stuff like that all the, all the time. They like built, rebuilding them boat motor. Oh, okay. It'd be a lot cheaper than the uh, the dealership and uh, they. The preacher man, her her, her, her pastor uh, took his boat up there. They charged him nine hundred dollars to get it running. And uh, wow. and I just talked to him yesterday. He talking about he got to take it back because it still ain't running. Nine fifty. Nine fifty. Oh, nine fifty. My mistake. Yeah, he had receipt now, and and it ain't been too long ago, and it still ain't running. You about buying a used motor for that somewhere? Probably still running too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I, I've been looking for used motor. I can't find the one I'm looking for. What you looking for? I'll keep an eye out up here. Well, yeah, you just tell me and I'll keep an eye out for it up here. No, uh, I'll, I'll tell you. I'll tell, we, we talk offline about that. Yeah. Because I know for the right price, you'd take a trip up here to get that motor, wouldn't you? <laughs> It might not take you two hours. Kind of beef cooking, you guys like the slow cooking. Slow cooking, uh, slow cooking. I, I like, I like the you. You know what? I like the slow cook. The darn Boston butt. Boston butt. But that's not beef. That's not beef. Um, uh, I was the beef ribs is pretty good. Yeah, slow cooked beef ribs. Yeah, I had to agree. Beef ribs, slow cooked. If I had me a, 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 a pellet grill with a timer that could regulate the heat, beef ribs, yeah, all day long. You got to get them one. Right and have them for breakfast in the morning. Put them on like a 125 degrees, like 18 hours. <laughs> what? I'm telling you, the, the, the flavor of the, the smoke will penetrate that meat. Like it, no other. You got pee pee? Yep. Y'all, I'll be back. Short wolves are so tender. Yep. You gotta take the puppy dog out. Well, she might need some more water. I don't know. I'll take that, but I think she got to pee. How's all the other puppies doing? They did it go. They need, a, they need a good home. <laughs> so they need a good home. <laughs> yeah, these two um, they're not three. Y'all can't come in. We're bringing y'all. Yeah, yeah, y'all can't. Yeah, we, can't make gas money though, yeah we might charge a little gas money <laughs> to bring them to you, but we'll we'll bring it to you know. <laughs> that will not cost you nothing. Just the gas money. And an hour, Luke. We might not be still here in an hour. Um, what time is it? Uh, 9.38. Um, you be back. You might. I don't know. I'm feeling pretty fresh to the now. I might see you mm -hmm. in about an hour. Y'all, I'll be back. We're trying to type and try to get me to. Got water. My water. A little bit. <laughs> Come on. Back an hour. What you gonna do? Go do an hour. Well, you got any plans for this week? You, um, next week? I'm gonna play it by ear with all we got going on right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we wanted to go. Do a little bit of fishing to uh, go this morning, but we didn't. Yeah, I know uh, how he said. He said he was fixing to go, but didn't. Well, I can stretch out my my knees. I can do it. It's I can sit more comfortably on the bigger boat. The little boat is still it it, it um 
makes my knees sore. I thought, wow. I'm hoping to get a fishing video or two out myself this summer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, Daddy got that new pontoon last year. Mm -hmm. He's been dying to carry me out on it. So, and I tell you what, I, I I love that pontoon. Sitting on that thing is like sitting in luxury. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Compared yeah. to what y'all be riding around in. Yep. Yeah. That's a, yeah, they call them party barges, ain't it? Yeah, I, I used to want a um, pontoon, but I had to get big country up here for one nose boat trip. Enjoy it. Yep. Best buffet. Best buffet? I don't know because so many of them are closed down. Uh, the KFC uh, buffet in Bishop used to be good. Yeah, I haven't seen a KFC buffet in a long time. You know, Wendy's used to have a buffet. Wendy's used to have something called the Super Bar. Mm -hmm. We did that Crystal video. Day. Somebody told me that they, Crystal have a, um, someplace to have buffet. I didn't know that. Crystal does? Yeah, never heard of that. What do you get on there? A bunch of, bunch of burgers? He likes six nine. Yeah, I reckon he paid like six nine. Let's see him. Yeah, I ain't never heard of that one. Here, all we got is the Golden Corrals left that are buffets. We used to have Ye Old Country Buffet. We used to have Ryan's. Back in back in the really old school times, we had something called uh, Duff Smorgasbord. Now, that was an interesting buffet right there. You'd stand in a at a stall, and there was a big circle with a bunch of food that would spin around, and you'd get what you want as it come by. Cool. Called Duff Smorgasbord. I think they still got some of those in Florida from when I looked it up. Like a I said it's more like mom and pop buffets than than they are the um, chain restaurants yeah. anymore. Yeah, if I was to name off a few that I would think would be the best, you'd probably be like what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like that Carolina fine food I was talking about, the main one in Simpsonville, the mother company, the mother of all of those, you know, has a big buffet in their store, but the rest of them don't. They even do a breakfast buffet in there on Saturday and Sunday, I think, only. Let's see, we got the, uh, we got the Laird's Barbecue up there north. That's a buffet. And we got a, like, a oh, bunch no. of net, uh, the crossroads up there. That's a buffet. Ohio is yeah, for food. Yeah, we got several of those uh, barbecue style restaurant buffets. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the main thing. Yeah, have a buffet. They have yeah, barbecue. Yeah. We got a few pizza buffet restaurants. We got CC's up there in Orangeburg. And Russell's over there in Williston. We got a Pizza Inn in Greenville. We got a CC's in Greenville. We got something called Dempsey's in Clinton, which is basically just Pizza Inn style buffet. All the food tastes the same as Pizza Inn. In fact, it used to be a Pizza Inn, and then they changed the name to Dempsey's for some reason.
Hmm. Yeah, pretty much. It, yeah, like I said, pretty much the buffets around here is the is the barbecue house. Yeah, stroganoff's good. I like stroganoff. Country don't like it. He don't? No. Me and Mama do, but he don't. Well, he did, and I haven't made that in a while. I like it on mashed potatoes. That sounds right up my alley, Lou. <laughs> <laughs> of course, that's your buddy. Yeah. <laughs> I thought he was doing something else. <laughs> She's doing good when well, she's being feisty today. She wanted her chicken. Uh, well, she said her Chinese is her um, her chicken, her uh, just plain chicken mm -hmm. uh, wing drums. She was saying yeah. that for the last two nights, so I hadn't. I just knew I had to get some today. Yeah, that Zatarain's rice with kielbasa. Yeah, that sounds pretty good too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We had this had and dirty rice the other day. We didn't put I didn't have hamburger meat. So we just ate like a rice on the side. It was still pretty spicy. You do anything, baby girl? Right. You don't like beef stroganoff, right, babe? No. I didn't think so. I don't remember correctly. Oh, I was sleeping. <laughs> I've been thinking about them subs that me and Big Country made at Halloween a lot lately. <laughs> Some of y'all made at Halloween. Remember that? The subs? Them darn things was good. It's good, you remember? He's like, yeah, his size wide. Homemade corn and cream? Oh, no, I'm just not. Meatball soup. You didn't want to do it better. I'm not. I didn't, I didn't have to. You weren't there. Were you there? <laughs> I'm getting confused now. Them pulled pork subs on that piggly wiggly oh, sub yeah. bread you got Yeah. Italian bread? Yeah. yeah, I had ideas. I was sitting right there on the floor. You got a list of the Something. Good enough. Greenville. Passport. Female. It's out of stock in uh, Fort Mills, but Greenville. Does. I didn't know that Greenville had a passport shop. That's close to the yeah. Greenville's close. But. Let me go there. We can just run up the times. Yeah, they got a lot of they got a lot of Bass Pro shops up here. They used to have one in Simpsonville and up in Greenville. Well, Cabela's and Cabela's and Bass Pro shops is the exact same thing. Well, we got we got both of those. Mm-hmm. The exact same store. We got a big Cabela's and we got a big Bass Pro shop too. I want to go up there to the big bass pro shop, the, the, the pyramid one in, in Tennessee. Uh huh. It, it got a big old restaurant in there. What they serve in that restaurant? Fish and stuff? I don't got no clue. I ain't never been there. I've never been. I, that's why I want to go. <laughs> oh, I thought you might have looked into it. I thought no, you might have I watched a YouTube video with somebody who went in there, and I see a lot of people try to dag on jump in there and swim with the fishies and get arrested and people try to catch the fish that's in there and get arrested. You just want to go see people. Yeah, uh, I want to see somebody get arrested at the bad pro shop. Really? Yeah. They got that going big old freaking bass in the aquarium. 
Man, I ain't lying. Now he'll sit here. Well, I watch it too. The and see people at the boat landings trying to put their boats and skis and stuff in and out the water. And people. They're just stupid. They don't know how to back a boat into the, the water. Don't know how to load a boat on the trailer. These people take forever to do anything. Well, maybe they just learn it. <laughs> uh, I'm hungry now. I'm thinking about going in and frying me up some uh, potato uh, tater tots. Some, uh, Gander Mountain. Gander Mountain. Gander Mountain. Oh, okay. They got the, uh, I got them, uh, I got some Arby's curly fries in there and some sweet tater uh, tots, sweet potato tots. Uh, we got some tater tots today from the grocery store that Sonic brand. Ooh, so uh, I can't wait to try them out. I didn't know I didn't know Sonic was selling stuff at the grocery store, but they are. Yeah, you know, Sonic oh, tater tots. Cool. Yes, Modern Warfare Three for Life Twenty Three. Yes, beef tips with roasted potatoes. Beef tips and noodles. <laughs> Nah. No noodles there, boss. No I'm noodles. About to say, yeah, the only noodles country ever wants is either macaroni noodles or um Chinese noodles. Or spaghetti. Well, you're kind of spaghetti. What you want, baby girl? Come on. No. Hey, y'all might get a uh a video of the boat. I might do a video of the boat. And y'all might see me and Miss Country tearing down the lower unit and replacing the water pump. They want to see the boat and uh, uh, fix it. Well, I got to fix the impeller so we can have some yeah. water running through the motor because I don't want to spend $8,000 on a new motor. <laughs> you got the leaking problem fixed, right? In the boat? Yeah. No, not he, yet. He uh, put water in it. I filled that sucker up with water right? yesterday and I found, I found one. Pretty good leak. The one, mm, it ain't so bad leak. Cause it got, it got most, it mostly got rhino. I think what it is, rhino liner on the back of the boat on the transom. Like somebody, cause whoever had that boat for me and before the person who I, I got it from, loved to screw holes in the back of the boat. That, that's what they they, they, they love to. Screw. They only tell you but they, they're not connected to nothing. So what I'm probably gonna do is pull all them out and put rivets in them, and then put some that uh that uh. Three, um, well, Luke, you just have to look the other way, buddy. What? <laughs> Come on. He said, it "Better be seen." You know, you know what my boat is. <laughs> nah, we ain't we ain't took we ain't took a a a, 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 a tally yet. We got the what? Be we got four names. That we're gonna put out there and we're gonna let everybody for one month. Well, maybe not. How long you think it'll take to get the uh decals? Got this donation burning a hole through everything I got waiting to see homegrown. You didn't you didn't buy homegrown. You didn't <laughs> donate money. You donated to help with the channel, not the for the boat name. <laughs> I agree, Luke. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's hard there. Oh, that's hard. Choose one fast food commercial restaurant. Which one would it be? Money equals BC. Oh, hold on. He's got to turn on you. He's got to turn on you. <laughs> well, 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 Luke. Now, all I gotta say, if you want a campaign for <laughs> homegrown outside of of YouTube and get them to come in and mm. vote when it's time to vote, we, there's, there's nothing wrong with that now. But I don't know what kind of that's hard to say because I like. It ain't Sonic. It ain't McDonald's for damn sure. It ain't McDonald's. Sorry for the language, y'all, but it ain't McDonald's. Marcos, Marcos is a pretty good change. It's pretty good, but they only don't. But you gotta think out of that deal. You only get pizza. I, I don't need all the other stuff. I just want to 
Y'all can have the burgers and fries and chicken sandwiches and all that. See, I would have to go more with, uh, dang, it has to be hard. It's for me. Yeah, it would probably. Because I can get the fried chicken. Around here, yeah. I can get chicken tenders. Mm -hmm. I can get a uh, chicken sandwich. Wrap. Not a Not a chicken burger, but a chicken sandwich. Um, I can get a chicken wrap. I can get desserts. Don't forget all that wonderful breakfast, and they're starting to sell that all the way up until noon now. I saw yep. all these going all the way to noon with the breakfast. I had uh, Mrs. Bell's 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 <laughs> no, that was good. Ain't you like them now? They were okay. Uh, I didn't say they were bad. I'm just saying. I chopped my sausage. If you go to Hardy, you gotta get one of them biscuits, man. That's all I'm saying. Oh, she did. She did. She got a sausage biscuit. Come up, put it in there. Wendy's for Luke. You see my bestie. <laughs> I got to look and see what uh, is that uh, like water pump. Wendy's. Yeah, you know. Upper repair kit. Uh, I don't know what the upper is. Yeah, that's what it Yeah, I'm sorry I'm not I'm paying attention to the phone because I'm Yeah, y'all yeah, yeah, know y'all yeah, y'all spread the word. Any of y'all locals around here, yeah, spread the word about for this for real. Yeah, but we need to go on quick. They I'm about to go uh order get the shots for the second second shots. I'm probably not gonna keep Darth Vader, so so there's three puppies that um something about the day double from Wendy's with mayo. I need your willpower, XD. I eat too many of them a week. The day's double. How does Luke keep from eating a day's double? Don't go. Don't go. That's easier said. No. Yeah, that, I know what it is. <sighs> Yeah, yeah that, it's hard to stay away from them burgers, I tell you. Oh. Yeah, oh, he's stretching it out. Yep, it's getting, getting better. I thought Luke was going. He didn't leave. He didn't leave. He lied to us then. He started talking about me stroking off mashed potatoes. He stuck around. <laughs> <laughs> well, it ain't hard. To, well, it is hard to do, but you gotta have a little bit of willpower. I'm getting ready to do some some cutting a back. Lot. Myself. A lot of willpower. And that's something I, I I desperately need. It's a will of power. Them subs will help you a little bit. <sighs> yeah, we might get one out this week. And if we catch them, we might do a catch and cook and we get some eels. We're trying to catch some eels. Shark would be better, but eel will work. Have y'all ever, anybody out there uh, ate shark meat before? No. Uh, have you ever ate shark? No, I ain't never had that. 
had it one time. My daddy and them have, but I ain't never eat it. Thomas? It good. It real good. I remember eating saying this is the best tasting fish I ever ate. Are you hungry, honey? Nope. Oh. Well, that makes a difference. Because I didn't, I didn't really eat that much of it. Maybe two or three little, tiny little pieces, but uh, it was real good. Getting about that time, ain't it, y'all? What time is it? Oh, yeah. 10 o'clock already? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm getting a little sleepy. Getting a little sleepy. And I keep forgetting. I said last time I was going to put a 15-minute thing on there and it didn't. Yeah. So we'll give y'all 15 minutes. Before we get off, all right, Miss Country, I'm gonna go ahead and pop it up on the screen as soon as she pops it up on the screen. She's about to put it on there. So, anybody got anything they want to say before uh, we, we get out of here? Can't you know I'm doing gaming this week? I don't know. I be getting busy, be getting daggone aggravated, and I get busy and get aggravated. The tree getting busy and aggravated. I ain't got time really to do nothing else. But I'll try to put a a, a, a video out about some uh, a live do live uh, gaming uh what tomorrow Monday. I try to I I'll try to do it tomorrow. Sunday. Oh, tomorrow Sunday. I'll try to do it Monday. I'm just asking you ain't did one in three, about two weeks. Three so weeks, like, three, four <laughs> weeks. It's been a while. And the gamers might not be. Yeah, they might not, they might be mad at me. Well, they might not be a record. I know. They won't be mad at you if you get that wrestling game out there. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You're I, I got to get me a wrestling game. I used to like them. The little boy, uh, the oldest boy, we, uh, I, I watched, he got a PS4 and he's playing Spider-Man and he, he's so excited about that game and country him was talking about the game. When was coming, what, Friday? Was it yesterday, honey? Mm-hmm. He was just talking about it. Like, All right, they got WWE 2K24, 40 years of WrestleMania. $120 at GameStop. $120. They can keep that sucker right there. For the they time. better have every wrestler that from all WrestleMania's on there. <laughs> That's for the, for the year. Or, uh, for that price. 50 years. 50 years of WrestleMania. Better have all 50 years worth of WrestleMania wrestlers on there. Mm-hmm. Man. Then they got uh. Some people will buy it though. They'll pay it. Yeah, Wall of Warriors. The Road Warriors on there. If the Road Warriors on there, I might get it. <laughs> but they got one that's uh WWE 2K24 PlayStation 5, uh fifty seven ninety nine. Why is that cheaper than another one? Because the other one has fifty years of WrestleMania on there. Yeah. This one no. Yeah, they're showing Hulk Hogan and Andre the Giant, but they're showing Andre the Giant the same height as uh, Hulk Hogan. I mean, I'm, I'm not, no, that's, 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 I might look into that. They got AEW for twenty five ninety nine. We might can afford that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There you go. Oh. 
<laughs> we got Spider Man 2 for $65. They got WWE 2K22 for $13.05 for Xbox. I don't do the Xbox. I feel like I got a hair or something. Luke, I'm a huge match fan, but the Lone Wars get two thumbs down. Oh, hell no. Domination oh. <laughs> <laughs> on the Heart Foundation was better, Let's Still love you, though, pal. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I disagree. Uh oh. The, the, the Legion of Doom held every belt in every federation, even Japan. Wow. Uh, the Legion of Doom was a cut rate ripoff. I mean, you know, they were they were the they were the first. The uh, demolition was a cut rate ripoff of the Legion of Doom. If you look up uh, the mass superstar, the uh, the member of demolition that played the role of Axe, his greatest role in wrestling was the mass superstar. He should have stuck with it. One of the greatest matches the mass superstar ever had was against Hulk Hogan. I actually enjoyed that match. But when he swapped over and became part of Demolition, I, I didn't like him as good. I think he should have stuck with his gimmick. He was the coolest mass wrestler that the Americas had. Vince messed that up. Vince messed up a lot of things, though. <laughs> Tom, that uh, WWE 2K24 fit, uh, for, 40 years of WrestleMania edition PC on Steam for $120. <laughs> for PC. The reason, the reason X, yeah, I watched the interview with him. The reason X uh, went down like he did, and they added the, the third demolition member, what was the name, Crush? was because he was somewhere and he was eating shrimp and he had never had an allergic reaction to shellfish in his life. And he wound up having an allergic reaction to him, which caused a cardiac event. And uh, Vince wouldn't let him wrestle. So they added, yeah, they added crush to the demolition roster, but he, he recovered after that, you know, and still wrestled in Japan for a lot of years after, you know, the WWF. Or at the time, it was WWF. But he had a full-on career, and he had a great career as the mass superstar. Okay. Much as all the rematches on pickup. Grew up with the Ultimate Warrior. Yeah, I remember Mr. Fuji. <laughs> but that's but that's that's the difference though. Luke, you watched a lot of that stuff up north. I watched a lot of the Road Warriors down south. I mean, back then uh, we had Crockett promotions and they were hot. They were hot in Crockett Promotions, which was uh, Vince McMahon's biggest competitor at the time, back in the mid-'80s. Yeah, Crockett Commotion, Promotions, they, uh, they were the first WCW, and then they were bought out by Ted Turner, and that's when, that's when it all fell to hell. Oh, that's the, the whole thing was drawn out way too long. <laughs> Speaking of the Ultimate Warrior, you know him and Sting started out as tag team partners. They were a tag team called the Blade Runners. They broke up and took individual paths, and Sting became Sting, and the Ultimate Warrior became the Dingo Warrior. In W, 
CCW in <laughs> Texas, and then Vince McMahon got his hands on him and they changed him to the Ultimate Warrior. <laughs> You know what's left, don't you? Mm-hmm. <laughs> they got WWE legends with Tim Buck. ECW. You gotta watch that. With ECW? Yeah, I, I love ECW. Yeah, Jim Cornette where it with Crockett. A lot of them started out under Crockett. I didn't watch it a lot. I watched it. It was short lived. I remember when uh, Polly Dangerously, that's what they used to call him before, you know, it became Paul Heyman. Polly Dangerously was his uh, gimmick. And I watched him and Jim Cornette go head to head. And both of them had a tag team. Both of them had the Midnight Express. Cornette had the original Midnight Express with Dennis Condry and uh, what was his name? Denied. Bobby Eden, yeah. And then uh, Condra left, and then Stan Lane came in, and Bobby Eden and Stan Lane were under Cornette. And <laughs> uh, Polly Dangerously, a.k.a. Paul Heyman, had, uh, he got his hands on Dennis Condry and another guy. I can't remember the other guy's name. And he called them the Midnight Express, and they went at it on Crockett Promotions for the rights of the Midnight Express. Which was another awesome tag team within its own right, along with the Rock and Roll Express. Where Shawn Michaels got his start, he he copied the Rock and Roll Express's gimmick, him and Marty Jannetty, and the Midnight Rocker. <laughs> I'm telling you, McMahon was famous for copying a lot of the stuff that worked out down south with the Crockett's. <laughs> copying a lot of their stuff. Yep, Ricky Morton was one of them. And man, were they over. Oh my God, were they over when the Rock and Roll Express hit uh, a stadium or an arena? The ladies went nuts over them, buddy. You'd think it was a rock concert. All the bras are flying at them boys. That's that's what got him in a lot of trouble there. <laughs> that's what got him in a lot of trouble. Uh, yeah, don't get me started on wrestling history. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that might be something we can talk about next week. <laughs> I can't tell you a damn thing about what's going on today in wrestling. Oh, I don't watch it. <laughs> but I can tell you about all about the old years. You know? <laughs> uh, 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 where you say you're from again, Luke? I wish I was in the South. Not entertaining up here. Oh. He's from Ohio. Ohio, yeah. Last time I went to Ohio, I, I almost killed everybody. So uh, I can't come back down south. <laughs> now, I like watching WKRP in Cincinnati. That was a good show. <laughs> Y'all remember the Thanksgiving episode? <laughs> no. I swear to God, I thought turkeys could fly. Oh, my. WKRP was a radio state. You ever see that, BC? It no, I've heard of that. I have. I have. <laughs> it, WKR, it the, it was a, it was a show about Thanksgiving. a radio station, and they, they was going to give out free Thanksgiving turkeys, and they were throwing them from a helicopter. <laughs> Turkeys. <laughs> they, thought, they thought the turkeys could fly. <laughs> they were falling all over the ground. People were screaming. It was funny. 
one of their own reporter was reporting it as it was happening. Listen, this. <laughs> Well, thank you. Um, I, I, was, I was thinking he was that dysfunctional in his uh, office. Girl, I, I can't pronounce your name tonight. Mr. GM. GM. On every Thanksgiving. They say <laughs> <laughs> I, I love that episode. An old radio owner of the radio station said, as God is my witness, I thought turkeys could fly. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, y'all. It's been a good evening, been a good live, good interaction with uh, the good folks out there in the YouTube land. Good interaction with Mr. Tom. He's like he's having a good time tonight. Uh, I think he might have needed that, y'all. Oh, um, yeah, I did. Miss Haynes, you got any last words you want to say? What or not? Mm. Nope. All right. I want to say thank all y'all. Thanks for the donations, the ones that donated and uh, the ones that didn't. Thank you anyway. Um, thank you for watching. Um, all I ask is y'all, when y'all come to Big Country's uh, channel and y'all watch a video, please watch the What's they call? the call? The ads. Watch the ads because that helps with the uh, YouTube and the algorithm and the payments and all that good stuff. Thank you, Mike. Um, y'all go over to watch Mr. Latchkey's and do his channel the same way. And as always, the channel will be linked in the description below if y'all not familiar with his channel. Um, if y'all watching this on the uh, replay. Thank you for watching. Come join us next week. Um, any last words, Mr. Lance Key? No. All right. Well, with all that being said, until next time. Hey, folks, keep it fresh and have a good one.